Have you ever felt like there was a task, project, or goal that you wanted to do, but struggled to get it done because life, also known as excuses, keep hitting you over and over? And if it isn't just the things that come up, it's the massive amount of fatigue you have to fight through at the end of the day in order to get something done. Because let's face it, even if we do have the time, it's so tempting to spend it vegging out on your phone or Netflix or just plain sleep. One of the most powerful mental models I've learned was seeing yourself like a rat in a rat maze. Your goal is to have the rat reach the end of the maze, but you can't control the rat most of the time. The reason being is we have a certain amount of gas in our gas tank every day and at the end of the day after work, our gas tank is exhausted because every decision we make, we spend a little more gas each time. That's why at night we tend to make poor decisions like eating that sugar-filled snack you know you shouldn't eat or not exercising or of course the pertinent scenario which is not getting your goals done. We become like a zombie rat just going along that rat maze. Albert Einstein says insanity is doing the same thing over and over again and expecting different results. So if you notice yourself failing over and over it's time to make a change right? So if you know you will turn into that autopilot rat, how then do you make this rat get through the maze? Well, even though you can barely control the rat, what you can control and manipulate is the maze, or in other words, the environment around you. And that's the key. Let me give you an example. For years, I would tell myself I was going to eat healthy, not eat junk food and exercise every night. But I end up snacking all night on junk food, watching movies or playing video games, and of course not working out. Using this mental model, I took a step back and observed like a researcher what was causing me not to get the task done. And the discovery was that my environment was conducive to an unhealthy lifestyle. I had junk food constantly filled in my fridge and my pantry, easy access to my TV and computer, and my gym clothes were nowhere to be in sight. You have to eliminate every point of resistance to doing your activity. I realized that if I had junk food in my house, I will consume it. So I literally threw it all the way. And I filled my house with healthy but satiating snacks. I put my sweaty, dirty gym clothes on as soon as I got home. And given that I know I have OCD, I knew that I would have to take a shower no matter what. And it would make me want to work out even more. I also put barriers for me on any technology when I got home. I know this sounds radical, but I actually cut my internet in my house at one point uh, because I had to set up the maze right because I knew if I turned anything on that that would be the end of the night. Do you see how I controlled the maze there? I wouldn't rely on your willpower because it's basically gone by the end of the day. What you can rely on is your ability to control your environment to get the results that you want. I hope you enjoyed this nugget of wisdom. I'll see you on the next video.